What is going on guys? It is Aimless Shot TV here and I'm bringing you another vlog and as you see in the title, it is called The Growth of American Football in the UK. So before I get started, I just like to say that don't get this mixed up. I'm not saying that football is worse than American football. I'm just saying how much American football has grown. Because when people think when people hear I talk about this, they're thinking that I'm saying that football is worse than American football. But in my opinion, yes, because I prefer American football. But that's because, as my friends say, I'm a complete American fanboy. But that's not important, so ignore that. Um, but basically, I just play it. I love it. Greatest sport, um, in my opinion. But I can't say factually that it is better. Uh, get someone else to check that out. Maybe go check on YouTube. Uh, you know, stuff like that. That's what YouTube is used for. Uh, basically, uh, just going to give you a few facts. Not facts, but you know. Um, we uh, just started playing the sport in the late 1980s with starting off with a senior team, uh, as in senior teams played, uh, starting uh, in the league. Uh, and eventually people um, came along um, and now, nowadays, we've actually got universities playing it. So, we've adop adopted the sport to far enough so that we're playing just like America, where we've got our special universities. Like, we look out, say we want to play American football and we don't have enough to go over to America. We actually can look out for universities that we want to play for. Like, one university, Birmingham Lions, a really good team. Um, they get good results, I think, yeah. Um, but that's what we do now because we can look out for the university we want to play for like because when people are younger and they're over here and they love the sport of American football they actually look over America see the sort of colleges and they go I want to play for that team but they know they can't because they can't afford it or they can't get a visa to go study out there so now we have the chance to play for American football in a university in the UK which is an is amazing to know because it was only 30 years ago or no less than that maybe 20 because it was in the late 1980s the the sport just came around and now we're at that stage where we've got universities nowadays we've got over 72 teams across the uk playing in the baffa which is the british american football association national league um and that's just impressive to know. I mean, you've got... It's just weird to see that within that 20 years, we've had that many teams come in and just play the sport competitively. Um, and then we've got universities. Over 4,000 students play it now in the um, University League, which is... I mean, it, it has to be said that this is one of the fastest growing sports because it's been adopted around the world. You've got places like Germany, Russia, just playing it. Um, like, we do, there's a World Cup of it now. It's not just America playing it, it's a World Cup. We've got the USA playing it, Germany, Russia, they're all playing each other. It, and now we hear that by 2025, American football could be introduced to the Olympics. This is just crazy to know that it's grown so much over the years that we could see it becoming one of the most popular sports. Now, I'm saying it could. I'm not saying it is, because everyone tries to argue me, no, football's the most watched sport around the world. Like, I know, but I'm saying it will grow. And that's the thing, it's going to grow. Why am I holding... Get that out of my face. Um, but I'm going to say it will grow. That's the thing. It's going to grow into a massive sport. And we've now got three... Um, NFL games, like, live games, played over here now, which is, like, only, I think, in 2007, we only expected one a year. We've now got three, and it could increase. And they're even talking about getting an NFL franchise here, which logistically wouldn't work, but I'm not going to talk about this video, maybe another video, if you guys want. Um, but anyway, uh, just talk about a bit more about what the sport actually does. Like, there have been a lot of people that doubt the sport, and they say, no, it's so boring, you're just hitting each other for about one second, then time out for about ten minutes, back on the pitch for one second. You can't say that unless you play it. And everyone who said that, 
they've literally come along. Like, I'm not saying go outside with your friends and throw the ball. That's that's not what it's about. Not playing, like, flag. I'm saying go to an actual training session where you can do contact. The amount of people that have done that, they just play it and they love it. They've been joining clubs all around the UK and just love to play it and just been playing in the league. It's just impressive, and anyone can come in. You, you could be big, you could be small, you could be fast, you could be slow, you, you could be anything, and you can come in. You just need that confidence and mentality to want to play the sport, and you can play it. Literally, I would wasn't gonna think I'd do as well as I would, but I mean now I I love the sport. It's what I live for. So you guys should really think about that. Don't put in the comment section that I'm saying it's better. I'm just giving you my opinion on how quick the sport is growing. Anyway, guys, that's all I have to say for this week or this video or whatever. You know, whatever I'm meant to say. Um, if you want uh, something specific me to talk about, anything, even if I don't know anything about it, put it in the comment section below. Check it out. I'll vote for the best one. No, I won't vote. I'll choose the best one because you guys don't get a vote for it. Thank you. Um, but whichever one you want, put it in the section below and I'll look at it. And hopefully you will see your topic in the next video. Unless it's done again, I'm not that popular right now. But, you know, thanks, guys. Till next time. Peace.